Well, hi there, and welcome to another episode of Hey, What's Next? In my hand is a 1080p projector my son and I picked up at Micro Center about a year ago. Did you know that Micro Center made projectors? That's right, it has the Inland brand right here, and it was on the box as well, and it's on the owner's manual. Well, we had a 720p projector, and we wanted to kind of upgrade it, brought it home, my son and I opened it up, and did some testing. And that's what we're gonna see today. A little bit of that unboxing, we're gonna talk a little bit more about who actually makes this projector. And is it any good? The Inland 1080p projector. This is what's next. The following box opening is with my son and I, completely raw. <laughs> I think you'll like it. Here we go. Open this up, you ready? Here we go. What's this look like? I keep... have no idea. Well, no, in here. Oh. It looks fun. Move it, move it, shift it this way. Other way. Oh, nope, too far. There you go. <laughs> Me too. Yeah, gonna... Oh, that's some very crinkly, crinkly cardboard. Mm -hmm. Two. That's actually larger than I thought it was. Specifications. Specifications. So we'll do this. Okay, that moves. And we're gonna go back. Little. We got, we got this. Here's the user manual. It's got a remote. Okay. And Focus. it's got an HDMI cable. Okay. Cable. Wait, that has an HDMI. Yeah. Wow. So, what's the wattage got, on this? It says 55 watts. Oh, okay. And then we got this. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's like faux leather. So can... Okay. My might need scissors, or might not. I'm gonna need scissors. Never mind. So it looks like just like a normal, normal, so HDMI cable, it's, how long would you say, three feet? Hmm. All right, let's take a quick break from the Dynamic Duo and let's look at ETOE's website. That's right, this is the manufacturer of the projector that was marked as Inland. Uh, if we happen to go into support and services, uh, we see the D2 EVO upgrade, the A1171. And as you can see on the bottom of the device, that is the model number of the inland projector. If we happen to look at their current version and just look at some of the reviews that we have here, uh, worth the price, but also definitely getting what you paid for. I would agree. This is not going to be like for you video files and uh, out there or audio files. It is a, a slightly noisy projector as you're going to hear in a moment. Uh, the picture quality, I don't mind it. I mean, again, we're coming from a Vankio 720p projector. Honestly, the quality is way better than that. So, you know, again, if, if I was comparing it with maybe higher quality projectors, yeah, I'd see a difference. But it's what I got, and I occasionally will watch movies. I like it. You can't find it anymore, though. It's not on Micro Center's website. Uh, I have been able to find the old listing, but for some reason today, I cannot. Um, so anyways, let's go back to the Dynamic Duo as we test the projector for the very first time. And I'll probably add some comments as we go along. Go, perfect. Volume. Oh my. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. It's so an Android. Oh yes it is. Can I? Head to about. Because that will tell us some more. Android 9. Yep. 
One gig of RAM. So this is probably valued at two hundred dollars. New and others. Default input single off. So store factory defaults. Date and time. It knows. The date and knows the time. Yep. Yeah. Android keyboard language settings. Oh, there is a Bluetooth. Yeah. Did you not see that? No. And then App Manager. I'm assuming App Store just kicks it to Google Play. There's the what? AirPlay knockoff. Your screen. Yeah, head to App Store. That probably just takes you to Google Play. Oh, no, that is anything but Google Play. It's like, um, oh my. Wow, this takes a long time to install the system update. And let's see here what we were, what's it taking? Yep, 54 watts. This changed. Oh, detected some. Yep, okay, cool. Maybe this changed. I wanted to get a couple examples of what I captured off the projection screen that we were using. Uh, overall, the quality, the colors is there, the definition was there. Uh, comparing it again to the 720p projector from Vonkio or Vankio, no comparison. This is way, way better. So what did you find on the internet? You found that the base price of the e ETOE mm -hmm. one was one ninety nine. It was on sale for one sixty nine. We got it for one twenty nine. So pretty cool. Yeah. I'd say it's a winner. Oh definitely. Winner winner. Chicken meaner. Alright, that's our look at the 1080p projector from Inland, a brand of Micro Center. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you've seen this projector, or if you have another projector that you really like, let me know down in the comments below. I'd love to read them. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you want us to appear in your feed, click the subscribe button. I do appreciate the time that you took to watch today's video. Again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode of Hey, What's Next?